Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Team Fortress 2. So, recently, I've been um, introducing some of my friends to Team Fortress 2. Like, they never heard of it before, so I decided to um, in introduce them to it because it's a really good game. Um, so, of course, me being somewhat good at the game, I, I was always um, the one that, like carried them in in the games um <laughs> since they're they're like both under a hundred hours so come on All right, gotcha um but yeah so i've been kind of like carrying them around and helping them through the game and getting them used to stuff like rocket jumping and the different classes and all the good stuff um, but recently that, that has backfired on me. Um, they've decided that they need to show me their favorite games as well. Um, and unfortunately they both play Apex Legends, and they both have moderate experience with it. So I got dragged into playing Apex, um, for my first time, like, um, a little while ago. So, I, I didn't want to go into the game completely blind when I first started. I didn't want to, like, jump into a game with them. So, I decided to play some on my own time. So, I jumped into a game. And, let me just tell you, I have an ungodly amount of luck with Battle Royale games. A bit of explanation for that, um... I had, you know, been hearing a lot about Fortnite, and I was like, well, I've been hearing a lot of bad stuff, I've been hearing a lot of good stuff, but all in all, it's free, I might as well just play it. So, I just jumped into a game, I, um, tried to figure out controls, I was like, alright, gonna, gonna go die, um, except I didn't. I just kind of got away from people, and I got guns, and um, I don't know if I even had any healing or whatever, you know, I'd seen some gameplay, so I sort of know new, like, general things, but other than that, I just, I just had no idea what I was doing, but um, pretty much, I spend that entire game doing absolutely nothing, like, I don't see a single person, um, I just keep on going around and finding loot. And so, <laughs> um, I keep on watching the player count go down, and you know, the circle keeps on coming in, so I'm like, alright, gotta get in there. But I don't see anyone. I keep on watching the player count go down and down and down, and I'm getting XP for like surviving. But in the end, I just see one person, and he's the last player left, and it's just me and him, and he's down on the ground, and I'm kind of up in the sky. And I, like, shoot him three times and I win. Like, first round of Fortnite, any Battle Royale game, I swear, I've never played any... I, I, I never play Battle Royale games, but I just, I, I just won it. I, I just did it. And so I was like, okay, well, you know, my, my TF2 uh, brain is telling me that was a very bad example match of Fortnite because you know yeah, in Fortnite you're supposed to use your materials and you're supposed to use your guns to build and kinda like defend yourself um I done none of that I'm pretty sure I didn't even know how to build so I was like okay let's go into another match and actually see what this game is like maybe I'll be able to shoot people and actually have some player interaction um second round literally the exact same and guess what I win again hello um this is Machkanar from the future uh, come to prove that I have indeed won these two games and these two games only so you can see in my career I have these two things I still don't know what they mean nor do I know what any of these things up top mean um I got some stuff I guess but um if you go to replays, two out-of-date replays were found, those are the ones, and here they are. I still have one of the recordings of the very last 30 seconds of my game, 
I don't have the other one because I thought that replays would still be available, so I tried to do that, but unfortunately it didn't work. But I was able to capture that last 30 seconds because I had my NVIDIA up and set up at that time. So let's take a look at that. By this point, I'm pretty much rejoicing my ass off because I can't believe that I won that round. Okay, here's the thing. I decided to completely stop playing Fortnite. I will never ever go back to that game just for the petty reason that I can say that I have a 100% win rate. Cause see, I I'm not wrong and it's not like I haven't played the game, but I I have a 100% win, win rate. So, yeah. So, can you guess what happens on my first game of Apex? So I'm not playing with my friends, just random game. Uh, it's it's trios. So I'm I'm in a game with two other people, and I'm like, all right, uh, time to get carried. And one guy was like level 40 something, and the other guy was like level five or six. I don't know what levels mean. I don't know how easy they are to get, but um. Yeah, that was like that. Um, and so I just kind of let them go. I actually died like three times. And uh, my teammates revived me. Which I don't know how to do. But, you know. The point is that I survived. Um, That's spicy. Ah. Uh. So it's like nearing the end of the round, I'm pretty much just following my team as closely as I can, but they're faster than me. I I'm playing Bloodhound, that guy. Um, he's the only guy that I've ever played in like my two hours of actually playing the game. But uh, nearing the end of the game, I pick up this really cool shotgun. It's called the Mastiff, and I learned later that apparently that's a really good gun. And um, so it, as you can tell, I've, I've died a few times, which means we've had player interaction. So I'm like, wow. I had more player interaction here than I ever had in Fortnite, so um, I keep on playing and I'm like, man, this is actually fun, you know? Um, and so we're kind of like uh, going around and we find some people and I don't know where the player count is, so I don't realize that they're the last team and pretty much um, I'm able to shoot them a few times, so I, I, I can say that I helped my team a little bit, but I was able to... Um, shoot him a few times with my amazing shotgun and then my team takes care of the rest of them and win again so my luck is just ungodly with battle royale games and I don't know why um of course then um I, I wanted to actually play apex more <laughs> so I got on with my friends and they taught me more about how to play and so now I'm actually getting better at that but I, I, I won my first three games of playing a battle royale game ever, which is kind of stupid. So yeah, that's that's my story about um, battle royale games. Anyway, time for some interactive player commentary of the game. I'm playing sniper with my trusty old sniper rifle. I've been having a good sniper sniper day, so. Alright, so, most people would like stand up there when the round starts, I decided to stand down here because everyone expects a sniper to be up there. Oh god, I flicked. No. Oh boy, that's a good old soldier uber. I'm glad to see it. Okay, um. Ah. Come on, I said I was having a good sniper day. Uh All right, good. No. Nice ragdoll, bro. No. Shoot him. Shoot the guy. Shoot the guy. Uh. Oh, jeez. 
Wow, all right, you know what? That That's good. I like that one. More of that, please. All right, good. Okay, 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 okay. We're... We're, we're better. Yes! Good. Ah. Oh. Nice stickies, bro. Oh, jeez. No. Didn't know what to shoot. Okay, we're back. In the generic sniper spot. Because it works. It works. No. Go away, spy. Bro, the people pushing the cart. Why? Why are you? Oh, no. They did it right. They did it right. How are we supposed to play against people who actually know what they're doing? This was a bad idea. Got him. All right. Helping my team. Anyway, we were able to keep this point for two more minutes before getting rolled the rest of the way back. I'm going to leave this episode here, so I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!